Info Factory Track for CSI, SRO Material Handling. Service Repair Order Material Parameters. Factory Track has several SRO material parameters to control the validations, displayed fields, and processing options that are permitted as part of the SRO material process. By clicking on the Label Printing Parameters button, the option to include printing labels as part of the process can be defined. Enabling the Print Labels feature results in the label printing form being displayed following successful processing of the SRO material transaction. For this training, we've enabled these parameters in order to show where these fields appear and validations that occur in the transaction steps. To start the SRO material process, from the Factory Track Shop Floor's Work Centre Navigation homepage, click on the Material Category Group menu. Then click on the SRO material icon. Note that the order of the features within the material menu is configurable. To issue material or return material from service orders, the shop floor SRO material form is used. The system defaults the partner ID associated with the employee. We then enter or select from drop down the warehouse. This is defaulted based on user form parameters. Enter or select from drop down the transaction type. This is defaulted based on the transaction set maintenance form's transaction type parameter. Note that if customer return is selected, an additional field is enabled for entry or drop down selection of the reason code for the return. Enter or select from drop down the service repair order, the order line, the operation. Enter or select from drop down the item and factory track displays the item description. Enter the location of the SRO material. This is defaulted based on the item stock room location ranking. Enter the customer item, unit price of the material, and the quantity of materials to be issued or recalled. Enter or select from drop down the bill code ID. This is only available for entry if the allow bill code entry parameter on the transaction set maintenance form was selected. Enter the document number for the material transaction reconsolidation or grouping in CSI. If the material item is lot and or serial controlled, the lot serial tab requires completion before processing. For lot track materials, enter or select from drop down the lot to be assigned. For serial track materials, the unassigned serial indicates how many items require assignment of serial numbers. Click on the Serial Assignment button to navigate to the Serial Number Assignment form, where you can enter the serial number manually or select from the serial number grid until the remaining value is zero. Click on the Save button to save the assignment and to go back to the SRO material form, which now reflects zero remaining unassigned serials. Once the required fields have been completed, click on the Process button to receive or recall the items or click on close to cancel the transaction. Factory track then performs standard validations in addition to any that are defined on the transaction set maintenance form. After addressing any processing validation errors, if the print labels parameter is enabled, the label printing form is presented.